What's up guys and welcome back to another Disney Cards and Planes diecast unboxing. Today I'm going to be showing you a, the last, one of the last characters to be released of 2016. He was also, he was released with Craig, Craig, Craig Fagerson, I believe that's his name. But I do not have it right now, but I will re unbox him when I get him. So... Alexis Wilson is from the Paris Parts Market. He's a deluxe. He's six out of six. He's the final car in the series. Here's a description for his um, the bio for his series. It reads: Fake missile and high schedule chase a suspicious-looking character through the crowded aisles of Paris Port of a Paris Parts Market. And some other characters you can get in the series. It's Ferric Missile, Holly Shetter with Electro Shock Device, Justin Parts, Tom Bird, and Justin Jason Jason Hubcap. And before we get into the review of Alexis Wilson, I would like to say that the my opinion Alexis is not a deluxe because He's just not, I'll, I'll explain to you more when I get him out of packaging, but from the size he is in the deluxe packaging right now, you can see he does not look like a deluxe. But yeah, so that's any it for the review of the packaging. Now let's open this guy up. So I'll be back with him very shortly. Okay, so here is Alexis Wilson out of the packaging. And as I said before, before I open him in the packaging, he does not look like a deluxe. And even in, even when I'm holding him, he does not look like a deluxe. So here, let's pull out Lightning McQueen for a size comparison. You can see he's basically the same size as Lightning. Of course, he's going to be a little bigger. But overall, they look very similar in size. Now, instead of ranting on, let's take a, a look at this character. So you can see, you can see straight away at the front of them. He has two different review mirrors. He has a review mirror as what a truck would have, and then he has a review mirror as what a car would have. And you can see he has a bumper, and that is attached to the base. He has a pretty cool um painting. It's like a it's not like shiny as in McQueen. It's um, it is shiny, but it doesn't like you don't really see the light. It's clearly bounced back off the metal. Over here, you can see some hubcaps that he that he has a spare wheel for himself, which actually match his wheels because I know they don't. Um, Mattel doesn't really get that correct most of the time, but. Do I need to for getting this one crap? Some more wheels. He looks, he has, he has, he's pretty happy with his job. And more wheels. And I'm pretty sure that red thing. I don't know what that red thing is, but it's something. These are barrels, I believe. And I'm pretty sure this, this car is mainly just like a tire vending truck. I'm pretty sure that's what the truck is. Okay, so now let's compare him to Brett One Wagon and Paul Oroke. And these two are actually pretty similar to Alexis Wilson. So let's do Paul first, so let's put Brett back here for now. But they're obviously similar. You see that the fronts are similar, the, they're short. And look, they are the same size. But I'm pretty sure I'm, they're literally close to being the same size. He's a little smaller. As what I'm looking at, but they're basically similar size. I'm pretty sure the only reason why he was Alexis was only released as a deluxe 
was because of these stacks of tires. I guarantee you that's the only reason why this car is a deluxe. But, he's still a cool car overall, but I just think it was cool to have Mattel to put him as a deluxe. But I still like the character, nonetheless. Similar headlights, different grills. And these, these two characters were seen at different times, and they're both also in different countries. This guy is seen in Paris, this guy is seen in London. So they are two separately different cars from different countries. Let's get Brat a turn. I know I look very similar, but let's get Brat a turn. Yeah, you can see that they're very similar cars. They go together pretty well as well. They look like they could be good friends. Two, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure these are delivery trucks and a tire vending truck. They look like pretty good friends to hang out with. Pretty cool guys. Okay, and that is, I believe that's it for this video. I don't really think we have anyone else to compare you to and I believe that this is the only guy I have from the Paris Parts Market I'm pretty sure it is yeah he's the only character these two were the only characters that I had to compare with Mr. Alexis here because I, I went I looked at my collection for like a minute ago or so I looked over all the cars and no one really looks like a good other comparison for him in my opinion so Brett and Paul were the only cars that I felt that were needed to compare with the Lexus Wheelsmith so overall great die cast great modeling great features great accessories but I just wish he wasn't a deluxe he could have been a single and we could have gone like a cooler um, vending car as a deluxe but nonetheless cool car in my opinion worth buying and with all that that is the end of the video so I hope you liked it have a good day bye